Good morning, everyone. Um, I am Susan, and I am on a mission to help busy and exhausted moms make healthy eating simple, fun, and lucrative. This morning, my um, one tip to grow on is my very favorite breakfast. I eat this most mornings, and it is my chocolate peanut butter oatmeal. So I'm going to show you how I make that real quick. Um, first, I uh, chunk up some bananas, and I'm going to use a fork to just mash them. The bananas, I include that um, just to add some fruit, but also when it's mashed, it adds moisture to my oatmeal, which will be important after you'll see when I add the chocolate. So I've got my mashed bananas here, and then I go ahead and I always make my oatmeal ahead of time. So this is um, gluten-free. This is just a Bob's Red Mill um, oatmeal. And so I just make that ahead of time and have a big bowl that I can use over several days so that in the mornings I'm not waiting my 10 minutes or more to get that cooked. So breakfast in the morning um, before school especially when trying to get the kids out the door for school. Um, I like to keep everything as simple as possible in the morning. So I just mix in the oatmeal and then I'm going to just take a heaping um, spoonful of my creamy peanut butter um, and I tell you, I like to use this creamy peanut butter. Um, this is just Kroger. But I like it because when I read the label, um, it says roasted peanuts and salt are the only ingredients. So a lot of peanut butters out there have added sugar, and there's just really no need for that. I try to eliminate as much sugar as possible. So um, check your peanut butter labels and see what's added to it. Um, I know that this one will separate the oil out, so the directions on the lid say stir and refrigerate, and I find that most peanut butters that do not have sugar will need to be um, refrigerated, so that could be a clue. And then, um, so now I've got my bananas, oatmeal, and peanut butter mixed in there. Mm. And I'm going to add in my um, chocolate powder, and I love that this chocolate powder is vegan, So, um, and it's got 25... Uh, whole uh, whole plant added. So I'm just going to take half of a scoop here. That's half of a, so it'd be a sixth of a cup. And I'm just going to sprinkle it in there and stir it up. So what I just added with um, that chocolate powder are things like alfalfa sprouts and broccoli sprouts, um, all in this powdered form. Um, yucca powder. Uh, it's got protein added, a plant-based protein. It's got carbohydrates, the healthy carbohydrates like ancient grains of millet, quinoa, amaranth, um, and also lots and lots of fiber. So I love that this is um, really making a complete meal and a very, very tasty breakfast, especially for those who really love chocolate peanut butter. So here I am uh, with my chocolate peanut butter oatmeal. I'm just going to pop it in the microwave for about a minute so it's nice and hot. And there's my healthy breakfast tip for everybody this morning. Hope you have a great day.